Hello once again YouTube and welcome back to The Domain. The shadow is a cast on a long night in Hong Kong over all these Billy the Grunts. And today, move aside guys, we've got the turret takedown. It's a small set, but it's honestly one of the ones that's causing the most buzz in the community right now. It's been quite a while since we got a new turret. You've got two awesome figures, fusion coil, the barricade. There's a lot to handle in this small set. And this is on sale in America for quite a cheap price. So it's super affordable, a really cool way to start off your banished collection. And we're gonna dig into this, build it, and just, you know, you're gonna enjoy some commentary, some updates from my life. It's been a while since I've done some kind of blind bag opening. So I usually use those openings as a chance to talk about my life, give you updates about the channel, talk about the future. And this is gonna be no exception. What are we, wait, 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 what? Wait, hold on a second. So I received this box from a guy called Outlander on my Discord. An amazing guy. I didn't realize this was inside. I guess this is just a freebie. This is a Call of Duty specialist battery guy. What the heck? That's awesome. I had no idea this was even in the, the like, th this is a complete surprise to me. He's got a grenade launcher, that's badass. You know, I've got another Black Series opening coming out very soon. I might save this for the Black Series. Outlander, you surprised me. I had no idea that was even included. What a cool little treat. All right, well, welcome to the actual video. That was just a random bonus. You know, I was thinking about snap building this, but it's quite small, so I think I'll save the next snap build for the Warthog Rally. I think that might be a cooler one. This one will just be a general commentary. Whoa. There we go, let's free the Billy. Hashtag free the Billy, we'll get it trending. We've got a Billy the Grunt. I believe this is identical, but there's no problem there. I mean, they're just standard army building grunts. In the games, grunts don't vary in color that much. You get a lot of the exact same grunt. And then we've got this beautiful Hazop Spartan. I was very excited to get this one. Whoa, look at that. <laughs> one of the shoulder pieces attached itself to the leg. I was looking forward to getting this one, especially because it matches with the new Mark 7 pretty perfectly. Yeah, guys, it has been a very interesting time for my channel, as always. I've seen a lot of fluctuation, a lot of growth. I mean, we gained a massive amount of subscribers recently, especially since my Spartan Armory Pack review. That one seemed to do really well, thanks for the support. And since then, we've just continued to grow. We're having an amazing time. My upload schedule has been a little less frequent because I just got a brand new job in Hong Kong's... Oh. Shout out to my microphone for not recording this whole time. I apologize for the audio quality at the beginning of this video will be a little worse because I was just recording on my camera. But here we go, we've got the Spartan Hazop. What was I even saying? I was, I was talking about my job. So I just got a brand new job in the city. It is currently paying the bills, which is great because we were sort of just living on the edge for a while there. I really don't like to, you know, rely on money, but I mean, that is the way of the world. This one should be a pretty easy build. Should be no issues really. So yeah, a brand new job in the city. It's pretty easy. I'm doing substitute teaching. You know, teaching is my bread and butter. I went to university, got a teaching degree in England, and I've been teaching in Asia ever since. I was teaching full-time last year, but then because of this YouTube channel, solely because of this YouTube channel, I've been able to pursue a part-time job, which I mean, just off the bat, I cannot explain how incredible that is. If I was told last year that I would be able to work part-time on YouTube and work part-time teaching, I just simply would not have believed that was possible. So it has been a, whoa, hello. So it has been a crazy year of growth and I am so blessed and so thankful for all the people that are helping me out on YouTube just by viewing and liking and following, subscribing, all those things. But then also on Patreon, those amazingly generous people, people that are helping send me sets right now, people that just like like a shout out on the videos like Matty Crafts. I just made a really successful video with him and you know that's gained a lot of traction to his channel. It's a win-win and I got to make an amazing video that helped boost the community. Like if you are a YouTuber that really needs my help, you upload decently and you've got a good schedule but you're not gaining the views and subscribers you want, maybe I can come to a separate agreement just like Matty Crafts. 
crafts and I can help grow your channel and you know in the process grow mine so I really love doing any kind of collabs and this will be the first time to announce that very soon I'll be having a collab or actually a series of collab videos with Toa of Ultimate Doom. If you guys follow him, he's a really awesome member of the community. He's been an OG member of the community for a long, long time, as long as I've been in the game. And we just started a video series. We recorded the first episode today. And it is a video series where we're going through every single blind bag series. Every single one, we're gonna review each. We're gonna give our thoughts and opinions on the best and the worst figures. It's a real treat. I'm very excited about the series and I think it's something that will grow more and more. So I love collabs with YouTubers. I want to do that as much as possible. I really want to get to the point where I'm collabing with some of the big Halo YouTubers, you know, wouldn't that be amazing if that one day happened? This is a pretty interesting build so far. I've never built a turret quite like this. And I'll be following this video straight after with a review of the set in a separate video. I think, you know, when I first saw this set, I thought it looked very barren. Like I thought the top of the turret just looked out of place, like it was missing something. But maybe my thoughts will be swayed. Certainly on the figures, like I love these figures that they've included. I always thought I'd love them. But maybe it'll take a little bit to persuade me that this turret is fleshed out enough. These legs certainly look like they're fleshed out well. Like they do look really cool. We've got the base and we've got two legs. All right, that's really spidery. That reminds me of the alt build of the Skiff Interceptor actually, these like spidery legs. I love the alt build of the skiff intercept. That is a mouthful to say. There we go. This is cool. It feels like it's alive. I, I love when the covenant vehicles feel like they're alive. That's what I said about Matty Craft's Scarab. And if you haven't already, you should definitely check out that video where I watch and commentate on Matty Craft's custom Scarab. I mean, a banished Scarab. It's so awesome and he does make that feel like it's come to life. It looks, it feels like a real living and breathing thing. Have I built this wrong? Oh no, what have I done? Oh, did I not add? Yeah, okay, I was missing a piece. Got to add it earlier. Well done if you spotted before I did. <laughs> and guys, if you haven't already, I strongly recommend you check out our brand new Facebook page, The Mega Constructs Domain. Whoa, we are having such a good time on there. It's so cool. We run monthly competitions on the page. Not only competitions where you can win sets, but also where you can be featured on my YouTube videos. So every month we have a theme and you can post your content in a chance to be featured in our community spotlight based on the theme of the month. So this month's theme is collections. If you post a picture or a video of your Mega Constructs collection, Halo or not, you have a chance to be featured in our next Community Spotlight video coming out on this channel at the beginning of next month. It's a real way to engage with the community, a real way to build our following on Facebook. I'm so excited with it. And I couldn't be more excited to be welcoming on more and more amazing admins that are all key members of our community. I've already got an awesome amount of admins and I just introduced Demarcation Media, which I'm sure you guys follow a lot of his work on YouTube. YouTube. Just introduced him as a brand new admin. The future is bright for our Facebook page. And look at this little thing. Okay, this is the set in its entirety, this little turret. I didn't think I'd like it, but you know, it's growing on me. It does actually have these handles, which are pretty cool. I don't know if the grunt can be poseable enough to get hold of those. I guess you could. His legs don't really seem like they fit in there. Maybe I'll do some rummaging about and get back to you on that when I do a full review of this set which will be coming out the video after this one. So I mean, you know, we, we've got a lot to offer here. They, they seem to be very generous recently with the amount of bullets that they include. Like, look at all those. I also, I guess I missed putting this on the bottom. Come on, Simon, have you ever built a Mega Block set before? Yeah, I guess I just missed it. Pop that on there. Okay, okay, that, yeah, that feels a little better now. It's sort of held off the ground. We got two base plates, we got a shotgun, we got a plasma pistol. I will be making a full review and I will share all my thoughts, compare them to some old turrets too. Thank you very much for tuning in today, guys. This was another video with The Domain. I hope you enjoyed me sort of just rambling about my life, about my upcoming projects. I know videos have been a little less frequent recently, but I have so, so many videos in the works. And another haul, which is going to be my biggest haul 
probably ever. So, I mean, there's a lot of really exciting things going on on my YouTube channel in the coming weeks, the coming days, the coming months, whenever you want to look at it. Thank you very much for tuning in today, everybody. You stay awesome, you stay safe out there. And the grunt is blasting off. Ah!